it, you see, there is an adage in Yoruba. They say, Tomodo ba baiton. Aba aroba, aroba kede rekumuni ba baiton. Which means that the Aba practice, what those ads does, has been documented by our fathers and our forefathers. And they pass it from one generation to another. Well documented. You know, in literature, we have oral literature and we have the written literature. The written literature is actually uh, accurate. You can hold account of it because it is written. Even if it is passed for 1,000 years, everybody will read, it, will read the same thing. However, the aura, there can always be misconception, addition, minus, and all. So, because we have both uh, parts, the aura and the written, the aura and the written part of the alternative medicine passed down to us, and we want to be sure that is this not just that our forefathers are bluffing about saying this plant cures this or this plant manages this particular ailment? We will now go ahead. What we do at Ashwa Jeletbo Giaba Therapy is that we go ahead and make sure that we do what we call laboratory analysis. The laboratory analysis will tell us components of each plant, seeds, roots, stems, barks that we are combining together before combining them at all individually. We work with a department of pharmacognosis. You understand? When they, are, when they analyze all these things in the lab, that is lab analysis. After that, an analyzing it is not enough to say that it is safe for consumption. The analysis will just tell us that, okay, this has some viral loads that can take care of viral infection. This has uh, some, some stuff that can take care of bacterial infection. This would help you to last long. We have detected that already. We will now go to another phase which is toxicology analysis. The toxicology analysis will now give us the toxic state of each plant. That is what will make us to determine the dosage and the quantity of each plant we are to combine. You understand? So if we have five plants, and number one plant has about 90% toxic state, the other four has about 50, 10, 20 or so, you know that that, that one that has 90, the quantity we will have to order to be very minute because of the toxic states of that plant so that the side effect will not be detrimental to the living or to the health status of the person who want to administer the drug they have to. You understand? So, the toxicology reports and the lab analysis will guide us on the dosage, what the apps will work for, the number of days it should be used and not to be abused. After then, we will now know that, okay, this is how we are going to do it. Then we will now have various stages various stages of production and forms. We can combine and turn them into powder that can be used. We can combine, turn them into powder and put them in capsule. We can combine, turn them into powder and form them to paste. The paste will now dry it and turn it into capsule, and so to tablets. Or we, we boil and extract the water and turn it to liquid. So those are, and those stages have different toxic states. They have different uh, activeness. When you, when you extract uh, with alcohol, when you extract with alcohol, the potency and the chemical formula will be different from when you extract with water, just cold water, soaked. When you extract with uh, hot water, when you boil, it's, that is also very different from the other two we mentioned earlier. So these things are what people should learn. So when people now say that they want to learn about practice online, I tell them it's just like they are going to the university to learn two things. Medicine and surgery, and you are learning pharmacy, ph uh, pharmacy. Because we deal with people who will bring results to us and tell us about their pelvic problem. They will tell us about their uh, kidney problem and a lot of other things. We need to know about the organs of the body, how they function, and what other things can, uh, can mitigate risk of being damaged. Yeah, so we, we, we encourage people not to just learn about practice from I carried my grandfather's book and I started practicing. No, you will create more problems like that. So in getting to know the dosage and the toxic state, we, we work with laboratories and that makes us to be exceptional in the practice.